presented today will make sure Tulsa has even more police officers. Two News reporter Max Resnick is here tonight with the plan to add more manpower. Max. Karen, 830 police officers. That's the minimum number of cops Tulsa needs to ensure public safety, according to one study. It's a number that hasn't been seen in more than five years, but the mayor and chief of police hope to reach that number with a new proposal. So we need to ask ourselves, are we really doing a good job of prioritizing what we need? That question raised by Mayor Dewey Bartlett to city council over how they can make Tulsa the country's safest city. A move that would first require restoring the number of officers on the street to a minimum level of 830 from the current level of 778. Without a doubt, my officers have got the heart uh, to give them the very best they can now, but there's only so much they can do with, with the number of officers we have. Chief Jordan says more manpower means more school resource officers. It would also mean more cops walking a beat, a way to encourage more community-based policing in areas like 61st and Peoria, for example. Foot patrols are a very effective way to, to target that and to get in amongst the people and get to know the people and really uh, have a presence there. To accomplish all of this, Mayor Bartlett is requesting that existing capital improvements project funds, about $12 million a year, be redirected not only for police, but for future fire stations in East and West Tulsa and for street maintenance, a public safety package. I really feel that the public is going to understand the need, they'll understand the significance of it, but they'll understand also it's a way to solve the problem. And it's up to Tulsans to decide if this proposal becomes a reality. It goes up for a vote in November. Max Resnick, 2 News works for you. Members of the Tulsa Police Department and Mayor's Office will meet again with the council on Tuesday to present more details of their proposal. New video tonight.